Hey y'all, how are you? I'm so excited today. The mail has come. My Baker Creek seed order is here. And I'm going to show you what I got. I was getting ready to head out on some errands and I stopped at the mailbox on the way. And they were there. <laughs> so I ordered all of these. There should be like 17 different ones in here. I hope you can see me okay. I was in another spot and it was just way too dark over there. So I'm just going to go through them as I go and we'll look at them together. I got Feverfew. I bought that last year and it produced really well and it's a really cool looking plant. Uh, this one will help. It's a medicinal plant that treats headaches. Uh, so you might want to get you some of that for your medicinal garden. I got the Damon KS Super Sweet Corn to go in our little cornfield. Let's see if you can see that better that way. To go in the little cornfield we started. This one says it's my pack of free seeds. What did I get? Let's see. Oh no, this isn't the free one. This is the Stevia. It just comes in a plain package. Uh, the Stevia is a sweetener. And you know, everybody's always talking about running out of sugar and we can't get sugar at the store. So it's a natural sweetener. You feel like there's nothing in here. I know there's got to be some seeds in these things. Anyway, uh, we're going to try our luck at Stevia and see how that goes. This is one of my free seeds to thank me for my order. It's a variety of Carrots St. Valerie. Carrots. These are the black tomato strawberries. They are new this year. It takes 60 days to produce. Uh, the fruit is marble blue, scarlet gold, and it says it resembles a luminous bunch of gems. So we'll see. We'll see how that one works out. Uh, I got several of the Augustasha for my tea garden. This one is the raspberry daiquiri. I got marshmallow and this is an African native um, its original source is an Egy Egyptian confection which evolved into today's marshmallow also eaten as a vegetable but we got that for the garden uh, some bee balm Borage. This is the Spilartan Mix Bee Balm. I'm probably not saying that right. And then I got okra, and this brand, this uh, selection or whatever of this one has been highly recommended by a lot of people who grew it said it produces fantastic so I wanted to try it it's the Alabama red that'd be good in some gumbo or some fried okra so we're gonna try that out I got the mountain mint for the tea garden I got uh, the Kajari Melon. I've been trying to get these for I don't know how many years. They're always sold out. And this year, I finally got my unicorn, the Kajari Melons. Okay, this one is another one of my free seeds. If you order more, than, if you order $35 worth, you get one package of free seeds. If you order more than $35, you get a second package of free seeds. So mine was a $50 order. So we got... This thing that I don't know what it is. Uh, Mizuna Benny Housey? Housey? Something. 
It says it's a newly newly developed Japanese heirloom. Nutritious purple stems and dark green make a lovely contrast and a delicate flavor and parallel adapt to both heat and cold. A small percentage of plants will have a smooth mustard shaped leaf. So we'll try those out and see how they are. I got the lime basil. The Navajo Sunset Augustasha. And I got that one also for the tea garden. This one is a citrus uh, citrus flavor in this one. It says the hummingbirds like it too. And then I got uh, the Apache Sunset one also. So, excited to get my seeds. I'm getting ready to place another order. There were several other ones that I wanted to get, but I wanted to do it a little at a time. So I didn't freak myself out with the amount of money it was. Also, I'm getting seeds for my seed vault for next year and the years to come. As I can find seeds, I'm going to get them. You should be stocking up your seeds as well. Hopefully the lighting wasn't too far off on here. Um, I'm outside. I have an appointment in a minute. But I was excited to get them and maybe get this uploaded while I'm out running around town um i was talking to you yesterday i guess i'll finish up my video from yesterday that got cut off on me um i was telling you in the last video about doing different gardens all around in your space they could be anything you know like i was talking about if you're catholic you could be putting a mother mary sculpture out there and plant things that in that time those were things plants that were uh, connected to her or uh, if you come from german ancestry and you wanted to plant plants that were native to that you know for that area or for foods or spices or things like that for the german part of your heritage or the irish part or whatever look it up do some research this is a time uh to be researching finding things if you're finding yourself anxious bored don't know what to do get a book start researching research your ancestry research the heritage research the foods the spices the medicine all of those things and start healing yourself the garden is your pharmacy and your grocery store. So anyway, I'm going to jump off of here. I'll get some more videos out probably today. I'm out and about. I might see something cool because I'm adventuring around in a town that I don't live in, in East Texas. So much love, everyone. Have a great day.